Hey, hi, howdy, hello. I'm Angel. Thanks for stopping by for another episode of Fit and Free with me in the head hut. I'm feeling silly as usual and I just want to do a quick leg stretching session because I did some arm stretching earlier. So uh, seems like the thing to do for me. I'm going to turn this way. I'm still working with a little bit of a camera misfunction and all that. So we just do the best we can with what we got from where we are. That is uh, definitely my philosophy in this life. I can't really see without these glasses. That's why I brought them. All right, I think we're doing good. I'm going to bounce these knees out. I'm just going to take a moment, a breath or so to root myself into the center of the earth kind of wiggle around and feel where those sits bones are. And instead of just slouching there, I'm gonna tip myself a little bit upwards, try to come up onto those sits bones. And without locking these knees, but uh, scooch over just a little bit, as much as I can here, deal with the camera. All right, so without locking these knees, and I'm gonna Take a, a little moment to relax the belly intentionally because I think we tend to, I tend to, I just caught myself wanting to pull back in the belly and that's fine, but really with a relaxed belly, I want to bend on the hip bones here. I think it's important to focus in on that relaxed belly because if I pull the belly in, that's going to round, did you see how that low back rounds back a little bit and I think that's a good in fact it's a great little exercise to do and I'm going to do some exaggerated version of that but I want at first to bend just slightly forward with a relatively flat back from the hips I'm aiming my chin for my toes and I'm pulling my toes back just a little bit and then I'm going to use my arms on my legs again not locking those knees if possible give those knees a little love just to remind them they're loved. And then back up. Ah, to neutral. I like to add a loud sigh whenever I feel like it. I encourage you to do the same, especially while you're stretching. But actually anytime if you're if you're if you're so free as to have that luxury. Ah, and if you're not, you might See if there's something, something you can shift, a slight shift. It's okay if you're not. I'm in there too. For numerous reasons, I'm going to round now, like I was talking about before. So kind of let myself tip off of the pointy part of those sits bones. Tip back. Rounding spine and aiming my forehead for my knees. I'm going to tip back forward on that sits bones, but you get the idea. It's exaggerating that for you. And then I'm going to reach out past my feet, or at least in my imagination, past my feet, and come on up with that relatively flat back again. Let's do a little turn to the left. Let's look past that left shoulder, keeping both hips rooted in the earth if possible. Ooh, I got some crackles in there. I'm going to just kind of bounce that out a little bit and then over to the right and over that right shoulder. Squeezing out some air there and giving those organs a little, little just a short ringing out. Bring these hands down, relax those shoulders. And again, with a relatively flat back, tipping forward a little bit more this time. And still aiming my chin for my toes. And again, I'm going to check in with that belly. I don't know if you can see that, but when I relax the belly, I can feel an increase in that flexibility forward. One of m many little clues I found. And then I'm going to round the spine again, aiming my chin for my, or my forehead for my knees, rather. And let's roll up this time, coming back 
Ah, to neutral, shaking that out a little bit. Let's bring the arms up overhead. And again, forward fold. Make sure not to lock those knees. Aiming the chin for the toes. Relatively flat back. Relaxing the belly. Bringing those arms down for support. And I'm going to use them to kind of pull the body forward. Just a little bit more. Aiming still that chin for toes. You can pull the toes back if you want to increase that stretch. I'm feeling fairly well stretched at the moment. So I'm just going to relax into that actually. I find sometimes this action, either windshield wipers or, um, well, it would be the other kind of windshield wipers, right? Moving these, jiggling these legs around can help kind of relax the muscles back there if they are starting to talk to you. But always do listen to your own body, respect your own body. And then rounding again, aiming my forehead for my knees. And reaching out past the toes again, coming back up to <sighs> upright on top of those sit bones. Do a little jiggle, a little wiggle, a little shaking things off. Thanks for joining me. I did want to keep it just nice and short and sweet. I'm doing a various series of these. I didn't rhyme at all. Well, I'll keep working on it. Anyway, keep it silly. Keep it real. Keep it smiling. Keep it stretching. Keep it strengthening. And you will be fit and free. Thanks for stopping by. Check out the description for ways you can support me and connect with me. Thank you. If you do, check out the comments section for ways you can leave me a comment. And thank you if you do. The next tap, ciao.